हरे कृष्णा माता जी जानवी कबीर संस्कृति संस्कृति जानवी कार्तिक देवी दासी व्हाट्स योर गुड नेम My name is Kartik. It, this is my name. Kartik. Oh, see, her name is. Were you born in Kartik, man? Yes. See, very nice. Satvik, Smriti, Danvin, Janavi, Kabir, Samskriti. Why don't you all show your um, come on videos? It'll be nice. Good to see you, Smriti, Vrinda, Kabir, Samskriti, Janavi. Very nice. Okay, Vrinda and Janavi are smiling at each other. Yeah, that's what I want to do. beautiful Vrindavan picture. I'll share screen. Hare Krishna Radha. Chagani. Just a minute. How do I share screen? Are you? Give me a minute and figure it out. Okay, so today we are still working. We'll start prayers. Radha Mataji, start prayers. Can you start prayers? Who wants to start? She's not comfortable. Okay, Balvinda. Okay, Linda, come start. I think I should put a slide of prayers. Let's see. Oh, Mama, start. Oh, my Jana Tivira Desya, Jana 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 Kaya, Shri Chaitanya Manobishtam Oi, oi, oi. Why are you saying uh, full? Uh, what did you no, say? Nama Vishnu Krishna Namaste Saraswati Devi, Namani Prachari, Hare Krishna Mataji, this is Shubhadrangiri. Okay, Hare Krishna. I'm so sorry. I, I'm always forgetting to add a slide of prayers, thinking that all of you know. But from next time onwards, I will add, okay? Anyways, so we are still in Canto 3. We finished Chapter 9. We are in Chapter 10. I know all these chapters are a little bit technical, philosophical, little bit dry, too much philosophy, but still we will try to see in a very simple way. Okay, we will not go into deep aspects of it. We will try to make it very simple. Hmm? So how did chapter 10 start? Chapter 10 is still a discussion where Vidura is asking to Maitreya, he wants to know what Brahma, how he, you know, this like the topic of this is divisions of creation. How the various, uh, you know, creation, how, how come they have created, they have, they have been created. So he just asked 
Now, in the previous chapter, you see Brahma's prayers. Krishna was very, very pleased and Krishna gave him instructions and Krishna left. So, after that, uh, he's asking, uh, Vidura is asking, how did all these bodies and living entities have been created? And Vidura asked to Maitreya, because he knows Maitreya is coming from Parampara and he doesn't say anything whimsical or imaginary. So, um, then what happened? Uh, because Brahmaji was asked to do austerities and penances. How many years did Brahmaji did the austerities and penances? Who can say? 100 celestial years. Yeah. Is, that, is that Mukul? Yes, Mataji. Yeah, he did 100, and celest 100 celestial years. And um, so various creations have been made because... We all have various, various desires. Krishna wants to accommodate each and every desire. So there are various divisions of creations. Like there are, you'll see what they are. Okay. Based on all of our desires. And then uh, 12th and 13th, Vidura heard of time and how uh, time is an instrument in Krishna. How time is Krishna. Time is also a form of Krishna. We will not like see too much technicalities of that. And how time is cyclic. Now it is August and next year again it will be August. Right? Our birthday keeps coming in a cyclic way. So we will also see Mata that. Uh -huh. So like uh, ne next month it's my brother's birthday. Who is that? Hanumanji, which is my brother. Who is talking now? Who is talking now? Mataji, you can clearly figure out who Hanumanji is. Subhadra. Huh? Subhadra's birthday. And Giridari's birthday next month, and Subhadra was talking. Okay, good. We'll wish your brother next month then, okay? Okay, now today we are starting from 14 in the divisions of creation. Um, there are, so 14 to 20, we'll see. 14, 15, 16, 17. Ah, Brinda. 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. We'll see, okay? Six verses. Janavi and Brinda can talk later. Because if you're talking, I also feel like talking with you. Then I will forget telling the Bhagavatam. Right? Okay. Anyways, so before creation, there is destruction. There's creation, there is destruction, everything. Right? So there are three types of destructions that is mentioned in 14th verse. What are those three? Kala, Dravya and Guna. We all know Kala is time. So the first type of destruction that is happening is in the due course of time. So there are th this, this uh, destruction with time happens at the end of Brahma's life. Not at the end of Brahma's day. It happens at the end of Brahma's life. So that is in the, like due to eternal time. And what is Dravya? Dravya is Prabhupada mentions in the purport by the fire of you know Anantasesh's mouth Fire is being emanated. And this destruction happens at the end of Brahma's day. Okay. And then Guna. Guna is one other type of destruction. That is at the end of this body. Our body is going to destroy when we die, right? So the end of this body, there's a destruction. That is due to our own actions, our karma, right? What all we are doing when we are in that body. Then our body is being destroyed. So that kind of destruction is called because of guna. So three destructions are happening. One is at the end of Brahma's life. One is at the end of Brahma's day. And one is at the end of our body. So three kinds. That is mentioned. And after that, they said there is nine. Uh -oh. There are nine creations. Actually, total ten. Because there is the first, first one is the creation. So, who 
is crying? Is that Janvi's brother? Mm, I'm sorry, Mataji. Okay. So there are nine creations. Um, and there is one more actually, one more also. So, but they say nine. There's one more total ten. Anyways, of all the nine, the first one that is created was Mahatatva. Okay. So what is Mahatatva? If your mama has to make what? Poha. What, do, what does she has to do? She has to. What will your mom do if she has to make poha or any 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 recipe to the matter of that? The matter of fact. She needs to gather the ingredients. Ah, she has to get from closet. She has to get poha, salt, sugar, vegetables. So she keeps everything together and it becomes poha. So like that Krishna brings all the material ingredients together and he keeps in one spot that is called Mahatattva. For now, that much is enough for you. Okay, let's not go so deep. When he's creating this material nature, first thing he does is Mahatattva because it has to be cooked. It has to come into being. The poha has to come into being. Then mom has to bring everything and keep it together. Like that he brings all the material ingredients and he keeps it together in one place that is called Mahatattva. So that's the first thing that Krishna is creating. And the second thing, so out of the nine, first six is called primary creation, which will be created by Lord himself. And next three are, create, are called secondary creation, which is created by Brahma. So Sarga is what is created by Krishna. Visarga is what is created by Brahma. Okay, it's all very technical. And the second one, what if the if, if if we all have to come into material nature, we should have an identity. We identify ourselves as this body, right? That is called as false ego. So the second thing that is creating is false ego. And the third thing that he will be creating. I kept it here, right? Okay, the third thing that is creating is um, the sense perceptions are created and from these, the elements are generated, the gross elements. So from this third, from the third creation, basically uh, power to produce gross elements has come. Okay, and in the fourth, he's creating five knowledge acquiring senses and five action senses. We all know that, right? We have total 10 and including the mind, we say it's proper rights in the purport that it, it could be 11th sense. So uh, fourth is all these indriyas. Senses have been created. Um, you know, five knowledge acquiring senses. What are those? The eyes, ears, nose, tongue, and sense of touch. And the active senses, the power of talking, our hands, our legs, you know, our... Uh, uh, evacuating place, then the gen generating genitals. So these are all, um, and mind is considered to be 11 sets. So next fourth creation, Krishna creates all this. And then fifth, he creates the demigods. And sixth is mode of ignorance, tamo guna. For that mode of goodness, fifth is mode of goodness. And then mode of ignorance has been created. And because we are in mode of ignorance, that is when we act as foolish, fools, right? When we are in ignorant, that is when most of the people make mistake because they are ignorant, right? When, 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 when we are ignorant only, we make mistakes. Those who are cheating, those who are lying, uh, anybody to the matter of fact, you can also give some examples. Can you give some examples of foolish act, acts done because we are I ignorant? Anybody can say Balavinda. Umataji, this guy in the picture is so ignorant. He's cutting the part of the tree where he's sitting. Yeah. Brinda, go ahead. Uh, uh, the, the person, he's so ignorant and he did so bad acts. So that's why half of his face is a human and half of his face is a tiger. Because he was thinking of tiger when he was about to die. Okay. What else? Who else wants to say? 
Me no, he was thinking of meat. He was thinking of eating meat and he died. So he became. Oh, a Tell me a few more examples. Thank yes, you. Yes, so but uh, uh, Mataji, I heard some lectures that Srila Prabhupada said that something ignorance is like gambling, like intoxication of in, in meat eating and eat, eating eggs, eating like uh, any any like alcohol. Like that, that's all ignorance, people. Ignore and then they die and become that thing. Yeah, that thing. And then the other person does the same thing and over and over. Life cycle. And, yes. Can I give an example? Yes. Like Go a, ahead. Like I heard somewhere, like they have grudges, like one person they'll be mad at the neighbor, they'll pl accidentally they uh, they'll plant seeds in their side of the garden and then for over years and years and they will never tell that oh this is bothering me and they'll just keep it to themselves and finally they um, 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 once uh, maybe 10 years has passed they'll um, um they'll destroy some part of the other um, their neighbor's house yes we do all those mistakes when we are in mode of ignorance any other i any other thought karthik do you want to say some examples where people behave in an ignorant way if you um stepping on an anthill and killing all those ants little ants for fun then you get the karma for that okay anybody else radha you want to say something so in the picture there's this guy who's cutting a tree like tree also has a soul and has a super soul and like if you cut a tree, like this you see the man, he's sitting on the tree and cutting it. So like when he's when it's almost when it's done to be cut, when it's like cut in, he's gonna fall down. Kabir, you want to say something? You are muted. Yeah, sure. Um so like if you eat the meat and if you do not take care of plants and and you do not water them, and you um, um, break plants, and you eat meat, and drink alcohol, and eat eggs, um, and you don't, and, and you think of eating meat when you die, um, you can, you're gonna become an animal when you in your next life. Yes, Danmin. Mati, I don't know if it's just me, but I can't see you. You can't see me. Everybody can see. You, I think your audio is on spotlight. No, audio oh, audio is spotlighted. We need no. the Vika Mataji. Oh, I think your video is not spotlighted. That's Mataji. Can yeah. mommy spotlight me? Um, I think I can. Am I spotlighted? Yes, Mataji. Thank you. Mataji. Okay. You're muted. I can hear you. Okay. okay. Mati, someone was talking, but it's like very, very low. Oh. Okay. So what are we talking? So you all gave wonderful examples of acting in an ignorant way. Oh, Sudevi, go ahead. Mataji, I'm so lazy to brush and take bath. My son is also like that. I keep telling him. Yes. Mataji, on the summer, I'm so lazy. I, yeah, yeah, I'm not so lazy that I can't get out of bed. <laughs> See, even Brahma and Indra, they're demigods, right? But they also acted foolishly, right? Brahma, Vimoha, Leela, Govardhan, pastime. They know Krishna is Supreme Personality of God, but they also acted foolishly. When I'm talking to you, I'm remembering one story of a foolish person. Should I tell? It is not Mataji, from Bhagavad Gita. I'm, I'm thinking that uh, Brahma uh, thought it was the will of the Lord that he should do this thing so they ah, can... Ah, that, is, a, that is another reason that uh, whatever Brahma, Indra, they all did Mataji. this to teach all of us a lesson. But... Um, but the uh, but the other way that the moral that Krishna wants to teach us is not to be foolish, right? Yeah, not to be ignorant. Um, huh? Earlier, someone was talking about like sleeping, right? 
it's funny because I don't know why, but on school days, when I wake up, I always wake up late. But when on on weekends, I don't know why. I always I most of the time I wake up early. See, it happens most of more in most of the houses. Yes, so it happens to me. Except that whenever I wake up early, I go straight back to sleep. <sighs> Anyways. Yeah, me too, Mati. Sometimes on the weekends, if I wake up early, instead of getting up and getting bad and stuff, I just take a book and start reading. Yeah, yeah I take a book, put it on my bed. Okay, we'll give a chance to Dunwin. He has been raising hands since long time. Dunwin, go ahead. We can't hear you. Can anybody hear him or it's just me? It's, it's very, very, very low. Low. No, it is very low. It is very, very low. Now, can you hear me? Yeah, but it's very, but low. very low. Very low. You can join from another device, Danvi. Yeah. Yes, I will. I will remember. I'll ask you next. Maybe uh, ask, check with your parents. They'll fix it. If you okay. have computer, check your audio settings. Yes. So I am talking to you. I'm remembering one story of a foolish man. It's like a moral story. Should I share? It's not from Bhagavad. Yes, Mother Ji. Okay. Oh. You should. About ignorance, people, and uh, and to become devotees. You know what? These Mati, days, from now on, don't even ask us if we want to hear a story. Of course, we want to hear a story. We're kids. Uh, see, I got. I always burn my hands for some reason. Always rushing. Today, I got a big boo boo on my hand. Anyways, okay. So I just get a boo boo and not even notice. Okay, so okay. So Kaliyuga's nature is to fool others, right? To cheat. Basically, foolish people get cheated, right? So what happens in Kaliyuga? Uh, like we trust everybody. I'm not saying in Kaliyuga we trust, but whomever we trust, most of the times we get cheated. If you take a newspaper, there are so many news saying that, you know, somebody else took somebody else's property, ran away. Somebody trusted somebody and gave money and then they ran away. The real estate people are cheating. The bankers are cheating. So everywhere there is a lot of cheating, 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 cheating. So instead of saying they cheated us, it's better to say we got cheated by them because we behaved foolishly. Because why? Shall I tell you an example? If you have a rupee, suppose Danvin comes to me and he says, give me one rupee. I will make that one rupee into thousand rupees i mean one dollar into thousand dollars in two days give that one dollar to me then what will i think i will not even give a thought thinking how can he make one dollar as you know thousand dollars in just two days but immediately my greed you know will not let me think like that then what will i do okay 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 then when i will give you my one dollar take it and i will give and what will then when do he will take that one dollar and just not show up and I lost my one dollar. So we are acting foolishly. That's why people are cheating us. Many incidents like that. Five years ago, even my father did this. He, he gave all his money trusting to somebody and they cheated him. He was in a huge loss because of that. So uh, Mataji, the moment. thing is, like, uh, my family used to be very rich. Okay, oh. the thing was, like, um, uh, the, uh, um, my, one of my great great grandfathers used to uh, give people loans, and um, in, for uh, for the insurance that they will uh, come and pay the money back, uh, they used to give gold. So we yes. had so much gold. I know better. Yeah, what to do? Sometimes that's how people get cheated by trusting others. Anyways, so there yeah, was one. Who, there most was one people who just never showed up. So like we just got to keep so much gold. Yeah. So once upon a time there was a foolish king. Okay, he always used to think like I should have something.
No, no, you you no, 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 for me, but you're frozen. Yeah, she is. She is. She's frozen for everyone. Yeah, she's frozen. A way you can tell if it's only for you or not is just look at all the participants. If they're all frozen, it's only for you. But if they're moving, um, it's for everyone. She left. Madhuri, your A going. Madhuri, we can't hear you. She came back, but she she's not able to be here. See, she's like. Hare Krishna, Madhuri, your voice is breaking. No. Yeah, it is. It is no. breaking. It is breaking, Madhuri. We can't hear you. It is breaking, Mataji. It is breaking. Would you like to join from other device, please? Yes. It's breaking, Mataji. Okay. Okay. There is some internet connection with Mataji. So, what are we discussing? What are you all talking? Mataji, she was about to tell us a story. Yeah. yeah. About, about the story, right? uh, king. He's talk she's talking about the ignored king story. Foolish foolish man story. Foolish man story. Oh, is yeah, there the foolish story? king? No. Yeah, you all remember there is one story that Mataji taught us uh, in the summer camp. I think Advait was there when Mataji taught us that foolish man story who were who was um, you know, riding on. So, Devi, you remember that? Riding on the um, horse or a donkey, and then they were telling them. Hey, oh, yeah, Mathe, I remember that story. Yeah, 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 yeah. Anyone, anyone can say either Sudevi or Advait. I want to hear. Um, anybody. Okay, Mataji. Yeah, go okay, ahead. Can you hear me now? Oh, yes, Mataji. yes, yes. Sudevi wants so, to say one foolish man story that you taught last time. She will tell and then you can continue, Mataji. No, yeah. Mataji, what happened here? There is a severe topical storm. Looks like because of that, we had a power cut suddenly. And now it came back, so signal is back. Okay, okay. So, Devi is saying that story that you taught us in summer camp, that foolish man story. Uh, so, Devi, can quickly... So, Devi, okay, you have to say in two minutes, okay? Because we don't have time. Uh, okay, Mataji. So... <laughs> One time, there was a, I think there was a father and son. So the, the father and son, I think they were going on the, they were going on the donkey, I think, and they were going on the donkey, and I think son, father, fathers, I think uh, both of, I don't remember really, but I think the father, father or son. I think they were walking with the donkey. Someone said, uh, um, let the uh, sun sit. And then the sun sat on the donkey and then father was walking. And some some other place, they said, um, oh, wow, what did this poor father should sit on top and then son should walk. And then son was walking and father was sitting on the donkey. And then... Uh, 
they saw saw that and then other people said why don't you both sit on the donkey and then both of them sat on the donkey and then uh, at another place another people said oh this poor dang donkey why is, why are you both sitting both of you walk so both of them walk i think the, both of them were walking and the donkey was walking separately so then they thought after some time let's carry the donkey so they carried started carrying the donkey and then uh, the and then there was a bridge and they were uh, i think they tied the donkey with ropes and then they were going and somehow the they got scared on the bridge and they left the ropes and the donkey fell into the water and then the donkey somehow uh, went and then he went he went and finally they like thank god we were freed of the donkey now we don't we don't have any trouble and then they went on their way donkey went on its own yeah because of their foolishness they lost the donkey otherwise they would have made money right this was in summer camp okay so today we will talk about a foolish king mathi can you tell us the story about a foolish king yeah tell me this foolish king <laughs> what he did he always wanted to think something different like how even little children suppose if smriti has something kartik thinks i want something different than her and even the matajis or generally the girls oh i always have green pink blue color dress so this time i want a variety so he's like that he always wants to look for a variety if the other king has he want something else he didn't he didn't want the same so what happened um there is a people who does this weaving you know if there is a cloth that has to be weaved by somebody right they do this they take yarn they what keep uh, weaving that's how it's a big process of how they make pure handloom silk sarees so one Mark, time they came they came and then uh is it okay if i tell the story no please after i towards the last okay okay yeah so um then this this uh, per, this polish king was thinking okay uh, one day the the weaver, the weavers had come and then the weavers said we we made this very you know you know these days they say a sari that can fit in a match box that means if you fold a 6 yard sari it is fitting in a match box so that light the sarees when you fold okay so it it becomes like a kerchief hand kerchief when you fold so he says we made this uh, dress for somebody in the other kingdom and then they really appreciated a lot then the king will say okay when that king has this same variety i don't want the same so you go back home and make something really nice so they will say okay okay let's go back so they'll say okay they'll go back and they will say we are making so they'll put a big build like you know they'll build up like they're doing so much and then the king takes care of them their rental their stay their food everything and one day the minister goes and he will look the minister says they're not doing anything so he will come back and he will say they're not doing anything and we are just paying money for their rent and their food it doesn't make sense the king will say okay let me go and see what is happening the king will go and then when the king goes my minister is saying that nothing is happening you're not really making any cloth for me dress for me then they will say no no we are making those who are dharmic only can see the dress your minister was so simple he couldn't see the dress can you see the dress then the king will think oh my god if i say no then they will think i am not dharmic it's a bad name for me so he'll say no 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 i can see the dress i can see the dress and he'll come back and how he'll come home and he'll think why didn't i see the dress so am i very sinful i have to become very pious from tomorrow so he will start going to temple start worshiping doing all good things reading gita worshiping the brahmins taking care of this taking care of that and the final day has come so they will bring the king's dress in a nice pompous way 
nice orchestra nice <laughs> with good music they will bring in a big plate they will walk to the kingdom to the king's court and they will give the dress but there is no dress <laughs> then they say and the king thinks do you see the dress is it very beautiful and the king says yes i should say yes otherwise they will think i am not dharmi yes yes it's very really beautiful very beautiful and he'll pay all the money they'll say okay we are leaving so you have to look for a good day you know good time an auspicious time and then wear this dress so then the king will keep the plate inside the closet and one nice day the ministers will look for nice auspicious day they will announce in the kingdom that hey today the king is going to wear the most celebrated dress and is going to come on a like on a parikrama <laughs> is going to come so oh, everybody is eagerly waiting to see what oh, yeah. kind of dress what the king is I wearing i i will i will give you a chance i remember <laughs> okay then um, the final thing he will tell then um, what happened he will say uh, okay <laughs> then the king will come he will he will nicely take bath with lot of scented dress, scented oil scented things he will open the closet he will put his inner garments and then he will try, he will just he will not see anything but he will just put it and then he will sit on the chariot with his wife and he will go around the kingdom when it's going on the kingdom <laughs> nobody can see but there was a rumor that was spread that who is dharmic only can see this dress not the rumor the news has spread so everybody will be thinking oh if i if i if i say i can't see they will think that i am not dharmic so everybody is like yes 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 what happened after that <laughs> where is he he said he wanted to say ha <laughs> huh? boy asked the mom Mommy why is the king not wearing a dress then everyone the king knew he got cheated same thing is happening now towards the climax <laughs> so the king is coming and everybody is whispering can you see the dress can you see his dress and everybody say yes yes we can see but finally one little kid says the king doesn't wear anything and then the king is like oh my god i necessarily trusted them and i became a fool you remember you know the president of a country coming like that he'll become a full shame right he will become a big fool right so the king has become a big fool just by you know he's like so ignorant he didn't want um, he was not satisfied with what he has he said like in the name of variety what did he made a fool of himself so not that is mode of mode of ignorance we are also doing like that right when we are in mode of ignorance we try to make a fool of ourselves my teacher recently ah uh, one minute we see hey, so i was hearing one minute please i was hearing one uh, small bite from iskon juhu where they were telling this wolf story you all know where the wolf goes and falls in a blue ink then the wolf becomes wolf or jackal becomes blue and she will go he'll go and sit on the lion's throne and they will think like who is this specimen you know wolf they didn't understand what kind of creature then he starts saying god has sent me i am a very special creature god said i have to become the king of forest and everybody's like oh my god i think he is very he is very um, you know he, maybe it's true and they will say okay you are the king and when it becomes evening the wolf starts howling like oh how do the wolf sound sound right when all the fellow wolves made sound then wolf started to say oh then what happened everybody understood he fooled others so our foolish dress will be real mate ji um god can if god did send as uh, so let, let me finish please our foolish dress will be unrevealed when we start talking so what i'm saying is when we talk our talk should be very good we should be very careful in what we talk because we we'll, most of us when we talk more we talk so much and we become foolish we start giving advantage to others mate ji how sura 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 one minute please okay so um anyways this is like we got little deviated 
I thought you like stories. So just um, anyway, so what are we seeing? Suraj, I'll come back to you, okay? So we have seen that there are nine types of creation, six and three. Three are created by Brahma. Six were created by Lord himself. What is the first one? Mahatatva. Second one is false ego. Third one, third one is the sense, sense objects. Fourth one is the Indriyas, the knowledge, knowledge acquiring senses, and the actual. Oh, 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 somebody has to mute, please, please. I think it's January. So, fourth one is the Indriyas. Fifth one is the Sattvaguna, like the demigods in the Sattvaguna. And the sixth one is mode of ignorance. So, we have finished seeing uh, what the primary creation. Now, we'll see the secondary creation. So what are created in the secondary creation? The seventh one is the immovable entities that are the fruits, flowers, trees, plants, creepers, which have no support, but still have some life. The, all those which are immovable. They are seven. Okay. Right. How many of you will go and pluck a tulasi every day in the morning? Did you ever did that? Any of you did that? So you just pluck like that or you just pluck like that or do you say a mantra? Manjari, I said to mantra. Manjari, we don't pluck uh, unless there is manjari growing. Yes. No, ma no, it's not like we respect Tulasi. We don't say Tulasi is just like uh, immobile or uh, we don't, we just respect her because we believe that she's a living thing, right? Tulasi is actually very different. Why? Why Tulsi is very special? Because Ma she's, there's a whole pastime with Tulsi, like uh, where Tulsi is like Krishna's favorite, and Tulsi is not like a material. Yeah, Tulsi is from Goloka, Goloka and also Tulsi came in the form of a plant, and plants do have life. That's why we, when we eat, we offer the boga because it has life, right? All the fruits, the plants, the leaves. The vegetables that we are eating, they all have life. So Brahma, the seventh creation was all these immovable uh, objects. I mean, immovable plants, trees, fruits. If you see in Vrindavan pastimes, Krishna hides. What was his last creation? I'll tell you. Tomorrow, I think you will see eight and nine. Today, I think this is the last. Demigods and the last one you will see tomorrow. So Brahma's created seventh one we are seeing. These are the immovable things. If you see in Vrindavan pastimes, when uh, the gopis, gopas, they're all playing, then Krishna goes and hides and Radharani comes and asks, hey, did you see my Krishna? Did you see my Krishna? And then what do the plants do? The leaves are like this, so like hand. So the, the leaves turn towards the side Krishna goes. And then Radharani goes that way. And Krishna, in fact, is like Krishna will say, don't tell, don't tell that I'm here. Don't tell, don't tell. But still, you know, when Radharani asks, the leaves turn that side, the leaves, and then show. So that means plants do have life, right? How many of us agree that plants do have right? And plants are to be taken care of with respect. Yes? Yes or no? Yes, Mother. You know, this morning, yeah. There was this big cockroach in my house. It was going all the way on the um, um, the kitchen counter. I was trying to catch and put him outside. I couldn't. Uh, and then it flew. It literally flew and it came on my dress. And it was clinging to my dress. And I was like, ah, I got scared. And I'm like, I was doing like this. Like this. My dress, go, go, go. But it really was holding my dress so tightly. It was not going. Then there was a broomstick. I took the broomstick and I did like this, just brushed it. But maybe I did it so um, uh, so little harsh or hard that as soon as it fell down, it was kind of, it's almost dead, but there's still a little bit of life. And it was upside down and, you know, doing like this, like this, like this. I was Mataji, feeling so... Mataji, that means, uh, Mataji, that means it's dead. Yeah, it does that, then that means it's dead. Yeah, but I was feeling so bad the whole day. I mean, sometimes the cockroaches they go up, they down. still they move their legs, but that means like they're trying to like go. Ah, but down. finally it died. Oh. Mataji, Mataji, I have a question. Who is that? 
This is Giri Dari. Yes, Giri Dari. You ask I if I can tell. Uh -huh. Okay. But I was sick that when, when I kill something, I say Hare Krishna. I tried to Hare Krishna rounds to them like Srila Prabhupada did. Like I uh, tell his disciples to chant one round because they are slug. I do like that. Yeah, you or or you could do Hare Krishna. Papa, then... got muted. No, I I was also saying, don't get scared. I, I will just catch hold of you. Uh, I'll just put you out. But, you know, since three days, I was trying to catch the same cockroach. So the point is, um, this is also, again, a little bit deviated. We are talking about plants and fruits. The point is, they have life. They just go vertically, right? Why do the plants grow vertically? Who can say? Come on, you all read signs. Why are the plants growing vertically? Because sunlight's vertical. Sunlight is vertical. Yes, it's it's growing towards the sun. Correct. Good. So um, tomorrow you will see eighth and ninth creation in detail. I don't want it. Go. What do? So it's eight o'clock. Okay. Today we'll talk about drawing. Okay. So the seventh creation is all. Um, all about plants, fruits, creepers, right? So why don't we draw some plants and fruits and trees and creepers? Can you get your paper and pencil? You're all very good artists. Hmm? I just put just as an example. I know you can draw this very simple. Rohan, your swing was very good last time. Very nice. Thank you, Mataji. Can you all do drawing, please? We still have 10 minutes, 15 minutes. Anything you can draw, plants, creepers, fruits. Just put the heading as secondary creation. You know, this canto based, like the, the topic that we are seeing, as I said, is like little dry. You might feel little dry and too much technicalities so i just went out of the topic little bit stories not not from the uh, bhagavata because just wanted to make you all uh, little ener energetic otherwise you're like motoji Mataji? Amma? So, so Mataji, we, we're drawing plants and, uh, and creatures. Yeah, see here, the seventh creation is that of immovable entities, which are six kinds, fruits, fruits, fruit trees, without flowers, trees, and plants, which exist until the fruit is ripe, creepers, pipe plants, creepers. So, anything you can draw. Okay, Mataji. Yes, put the heading as secondary creation. By Brahma, and then you go. Mataji, can you? Know, I always say, please keep a book. It will be very nice. You draw on a paper and you throw the paper. Instead of that, you can write the canto number, chapter number, shloka number, and then draw. It will be like a good memory when you grow. Papers, you just throw it into the trash. Mataji, do we put it in the group or Mataji, can you yes, you have to draw and put it in the group, of course. Mataji, can you show the pictures real quick? Which picture? Um, which picture? Um, all of them. Mataji. A, I, this here, this one. So there are only two, Mataji? Yeah, I just took two as an example. You can draw anything. You can put creepers, vines. Around the tree, you can put some creepers just here at the bottom so that there is tree, there is fruits, then there is a creeper. You can come up with creativity. Ataji, can you show the other picture? Other picture? This is very easy, Nana. 
just a pot in the plant. Next, birds and um, the other creation, you will see tomorrow. Can you go to the first one, Mataji? Yeah, this, this is the first one, this is the second. Okay, thank you. Hare Krishna, Mataji. Hare Krishna. Mataji, uh, Suraj is saying, no, I cannot draw plants, trees. I can only draw you and me. So I said, uh, we should never draw boundaries and uh, limit ourselves. So we, we should try. Please Suraj. encourage Mataji. Yeah, where is Suraj? Suraj, Suraj come is on. You're a fifth, fourth grader? Fifth grader? Sixth. Oh my God. Sixth grader is saying he cannot draw a plant. I'm going to call Dina Krishna and Bala Brinda. They're going to draw just like that. You can do it. Come on, please. I want to see. See, last mm. time you made the thing so nicely, but I think you are so tired towards the last, but that's okay. Plant is not like that. You can do it. You can close your eyes. Mataji? Oh, Otherwise, Brahma Mataji. is going to be very angry. Huh? Suraj, when it comes to secondary creation, you are not drawing. Draw. Mataji? Amma, who is calling? This is Shubhadra. Uh, can, you, can you do the second picture, the plant picture? Yes. Do you want to draw? Uh, you tired? To take screen to put another tree, not this one. Snip to. Uh. Yeah. I want you mm -hmm. to draw both if possible. As I said, you can draw a tree. And you can put small plants here at the bottom. Just a twig and some leaves. Small plants. Mataji, can you, put, can you put it on the plant? The first one? Yeah. The first one is very easy. Maybe I should have put both in. Screenshot, screenshot. Print screen taste for Mataji, what is Because Mataji Ma keeps Mataji. Me, uh, swapping between both. Suraj, I'm waiting to see yours. Mataji, what if you um what Mataji, if you could you, uh, you, uh, you, you can just draw Tulasi? You can draw a forest. Like I know you're Mataji, all Mataji, could you show the screenshot to the tree? You are all so artistic. You can draw Tulasi or big forest, big big tree, coconut tree. So there is eating. There is hungry. Mataji. Ma. How about, how about everyone can screenshot uh, in their computer? But um, I think I think computers cannot screenshot. <laughs> yes, you can try. So it's like, um, you can if, if everyone can screenshot, then like um, everyone doesn't need to. Yeah, Minita Kandarvika Mataji sent it in the group. Can you put the other picture? I will send that also in the group. How about the tree with pizza, pasta, cupcakes? Wow. <laughs> Maybe, yes, Lord Brahma hears to you. Ah, how nice that is. Then the moms don't have to cook. You can just pluck it from the tree, pack in your dabba and go to school. Mataji, <laughs> did you know there's a, a, a tree that grows dark chocolate? Chocolate? Yeah, there is a tree that grows dark chocolate. That, yeah, I think that, that the dark chocolate comes from that bean, right? Cocoa bean? Yeah, you take that, you grind it up and make it a solid again. Okay, oh, you give it shape and that is it. It's mm -hmm. dark chocolate. Oh, yeah. Are you drawing? Another pencil? Yeah, I'm drawing. I need to find the eraser. May I find it? May I have the, well, the biggest one? This one is perfect. Mataji, you can Vrindavan also is called like Golab Vrindavan is also called a Kalpavriksha tree, right? Whatever we desire, it will happen. Golab Vrindavan is a Kalpavriksha tree. 
please like hama can you go to the please like actually i shared this uh, screenshots in the whatsapp uh, you can go on the whatsapp and check it okay if anybody want it if somebody is drawing the tree, somebody is drawing the tree so you can be easily checking on your whatsapp mother ji can you see my drawing oh so giridari yes mother ji is it giridari yes mother yes, yes mother you can see ah, why did you keep the pot on top of the tree ha ah. मैंगोज ओके ओके ड्रॉ i'm telling again and again my request please keep a book it might not make sense now when you grow big it will really make sense you can see your work i need i have a book but nothing is organized so okay but just keep the book without tearing the pages you keep it then after 10 years you will remember bhakti sangha you will remember what you have learned be very nice ma can i also you say to get a scholarship to college Yes, Mataji? I still have all, all my college records and everything, all my drawings. Mat Mataji, Amma, we're still going to join the Bhakti Singh Japa group because because on Mondays because there's always Madhava classes. One uh, one time, me and my brother, when I was like seven, and when my brother was still nine, I think. No way! When my brother was eight, and I was. Um, Seven. Then we join the um, the math class for Monday. So I think when we when done we... when you are done, you are raising hand. Yes, Shubhadra. Good. I know you join all the classes. Wonderful. Oh, Samskriti. Actually, we had a new group. Samskriti, you have to join into that group. I will send it to your mom's phone registration um, Google form. You have to register, and then you will enter into the new group. Wait, so but the um, oh, you're talking to some. Currently, you are in Madhava. How old are you, and your brother? I met Samskriti la upon Janmashtami. She came running to me in Alachwa. Then I I saw him. I was like, I saw this little girl somewhere. In once one minute, I got remem reminded that she was Samskriti. Then I met her mom. She's such a sweet kid, helping her mom. She was so quiet and calm, not cranky and naughty. Thank you, Mataji. Mataji, I will see you again for Radha Shmi Samskriti. Okay. Mataji, where do you live? Just sit there in silence. I don't live in Alachua. Danvan, what's your question? You have your hand raised. Yeah, he's been raising. Are you done? Are you done drawing? His voice. Masichi, where do you live? I live in Tampa, Florida, two hours from Florida? Florida. Uh huh. Danvin, you finished drawing. I thought you, you lived in uh, somewhere like up near Mexico. Yeah, Mexico. 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 I'll stop sharing in spotlight. It is so light. Can you can you get it to the closer to the camera? Oh, I think it's time. We have to go to break. Yeah, yeah. Very beautiful. Good job. Post it in the group. Okay, everybody will see. Mata ji. Ah, uh, I'm surprised you're taking a small tree so long. I'm done. Who is done? We are also done. It's time. Uh -huh. We are there. Next class. Radha, Radha, Radha. Radha. Yes, Radha. Show me. Uh, 
Ah, uh, look at Radha's drawing. She's drew to this like she. Oh, is that you, Radha? That girl? Yes. Wonderful. That's the mango saying, "Hey, you, pick me up." Okay, please send it in the group. It's it'll be more clear. Okay. okay? Don't forget. Send it in the okay. group. Matishu, I drew a tree with um, not many mango. Um, okay, Suraj, good job. You didn't write any title heading, please. Radha has done. Suraj, Danvin, uh, Giridhari, Janavi, are you done? Matichi, actually today is back to school night, so I don't, I can't really draw or uh, both. I think we have to end the call because they have a next class. Wow, Rohan, very nice. Look at this color combination, wonderful. Send it in the group. Okay, Matichi. Okay, who didn't draw? Sudevi, Ojasvi, you please send later, okay? Matichi, I'm drawing. Okay, draw, send it in the group. Samskriti, I sent you the details. Okay, you please register to the course and then you will Kabir, be Kabir, very nice. Good job. All of you send it in the group. I'll see all, all of yours together. Kabir, okay, Mataji. Mataji, I'm still drawing, but I'll try, I'll try to send it in the group. Kartik is drawing. Okay. Abhigya, are you drawing? Yes, Mataji. Okay. And then Mataji. So let's see, Manjari is joining, I think, next class. Yes, Mataji, we can close here. Hare Krishna, kids. Hope you all drew. And then um, share the pictures in the group. We will close. Mataji, Mataji. Ah, do it. Um, I just wanted to ask if you can, um, like, add me to the Madhava group also. Good. Mataji? Uh, quick, quick. Um, so, like, so, like, um, uh. um, I'm not copying from the, uh, I'm not copying from the picture that you just handed me. Okay, okay, that's what I said. You can be creative. It's just an idea. See, Mataji joined. I'm, like I'm just doing, I'm just doing blossom flowers, like, like, uh, lotus flowers. As soon as you said blossom flower, Supasagari Mataji's face came up. <laughs> I'm on video. Oh my god! Yeah. It it should it should have been uh, rotten flowers. No, Mataji. Sorry, there was a thunderstorm, and uh, in between ten minutes, we got late. I I had my, there was no power in my house, and then little lapse. So we'll end the call, Mataji. You can leave. Oh, no worries. Thank you so much. Hare Krishna. Thank you to all of you for being so nice. Bye. Good night, all of you. See you all next time. Okay, please send in the group. I'll be waiting to see drawings. Bye. Bye-bye.